I'm Chris with Metters Musings, Toys, Tech, and more, here with another video for iPhone in Canada. Now I'm gonna go over a little fix here. I know that the Apple Watch is brand new and some people aren't getting their notifications for messages or for emails. Now I was one of those people who was having trouble with that when I first got the watch. But I've come up with a little bit of a fix that works for me and hopefully it can help you as well. So right there I can feel the tapping, the haptic uh, motion on my wrist. If I touch the screen right there, you can see that I did get a message from my wife. She's asking me, what's for supper tonight? So as you can see, the messages are coming through on mine. I did get the haptic feedback on my wrist there, so you can see that it is working. So if you are having issues, the first thing you're going to want to do is you want to grab your phone and you're going to go to your Apple Watch and you're going to go here and you're going to go to notifications. I mean, you're going to have your notifications on. You can check your um, settings right here. And what you want to do is when you first launch it, when you first start it up, everything is going to be mirror my iPhone. Now I found when I had that on, it wasn't necessarily working. So I tapped on custom. Now what I did is show alerts. This is for my ma uh, mail. And then you can choose which me email addresses you want on there. You can have them on or off. And then of course you can do the exact same thing for your messages. Take it off mirror my iPhone and then go on to the custom. You can show alerts, the haptic. I don't really want the sound for the uh, text messages. I want it to be as discreet as possible. So yeah, that's what helped me the most although it was a little bit sporadic. Sometimes it didn't work. So I found another step, then now I get them 100% of the times. If you go into settings, onto your phone, go to notifications, pick your phone, make sure that you have allow notifications, the badge icon, the show on the lock screen, make sure you're picking which one you want. Again, do that as well for your messages, allow notifications, the badge icon, Again, which type of uh, indication you want, I don't think it really matters. But as soon as I did that, as soon as I had all that turned on, I have yet to miss a notification from email or from the iMessage. So yeah, I'm really happy to say that it is working 100% of the time now. So there we go again, I just felt uh, the little haptic touch there. We're gonna check to see what we've got here. And we've got an email now from my wife and it says, hi honey. So there we go. Oh, and you heard the little ding there, I think. So there we go, you can see that my notifications through iMessage and through my email are working. They are coming through to my watch. So hopefully this can help you. I'm not gonna guarantee that it's going to help you, but it, it worked for me, so again, I'm hoping that it'll work for you. Again, this is a first-gen product. It is the first software. I know Apple is working on a software update, so it may improve things a little bit, but again, if you follow these steps, hopefully it will help you and get you using your notifications onto your watch from your email and from your iMessage. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, a like would be appreciated. Feel free to leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to subscribe. That way you're not going to miss any videos here on Metters Musings, Toys, Tech, and more. And of course, we're going to have a lot more helps and how-to videos here coming up with the Apple Watch. So thanks so much for watching and have a great day.